craziest bastards I've ever met in my life. I love everyone. What's going on, you crazy bastards? You're back here with Rob Kimball brand for a WWE NXT review and we have chaos at the end of the show you have Samoa Joe standing on top what the hell happened did he even have a match Baron Corbin he got into the mix things are going crazy but we get it starting off with Asuka versus Cameron where the hell has she been Cameron the Funkadactyl <laughs> yeah, it is what it is she comes on out and gets her ass pretty much kicked. Um, Asuka is so goddamn fast, lightning quick, but Cameron did work on her game. Finally, she did. She looked a lot better than she used to, and uh, she kept up with Asuka, but the Asuka lock finishes her off, and uh, very talented. Asuka is fast and just puts together moves. It's awesome, I like it. Then we have Jordan and Gable, and they're backstage. They want the ascension, something to prove, beat the shit out of these guys, and we're moving on up. They're ascending, and uh, these guys are over as hell. Their matches, wow, just phenomenal. So bring the ascension back. Connor and Victor, look out. Um, they, they got the thing working with Stardust, but for tag team wise, come on back, get your ass whooped, and we'll see what happens. But. Boy, they were so much better when they were in NXT. When they got called up, they fucked it up. Then you got Bull Dempsey versus Dawkins. And Dawkins got some new gimmick going on with Chef cooking and shit. Well, anyway, Bull Dempsey ate all the carbs that he was cooking and hit him up with a little bull fit and ended this motherfucking match. Kick some ass, and that's that. And Fulton, he's pissed off because his goddamn braids are too damn tight and quits. <laughs> Dawkins and that's it so who knows it looks like that they're done and they need to be so then you got Ava Marie and some Jersey girl I didn't know who she was it sounded like the crowd was chanting Hardy through the whole thing so maybe she maybe that's one of her last name I don't know didn't look it up and uh, you knew where this was going all read everything kick some ass gets another win and a little bit better of a win than her previous ones, but still has a lot of work to go. And championship aspirations needs to be about a year away, not anywhere near now. So simple as that. Needs a lot of work. She's got the look, obviously, but needs a lot of work. Then we have the main event, Apollo Crews versus Finn Balor. And holy shit, these guys Wow, just phenomenal. This match was badass, kick-ass. If you didn't watch it, go to the WWE Network and watch this match because it was on fire. Apollo Crews showed a lot of what he can do. Finn Balor is, you know, kicks ass. And so we got so many back and forths, just phenomenal stuff. And um, they're trying to one up each other, one up each other, but in the end, Baron Corbin comes out, DQ, he's beating the shit out of both of them, trying to be the bigger man. Samoa Joe comes running out for the save. Baron Corbin, he's out of there. And Finn Balor is the only one in the ring. Samoa Joe, he turns. Samoa Joe turns on Finn Balor after they won the Dusty Rhodes Classic. And uh, yeah, beats the shit out of him. Hits a muscle buster and then drapes the belt over him. Standing tall, Samoa Joe, the biggest asshole of the night. <laughs> but anyway, going into heel mode, Samoa Joe can do it and it's awesome. And it looks like this is going to be the next feud. And uh, he caused a little chaos to Finn Balor. So where's that going? Where does Apollo Crews end up? And uh, the Apollo Crews, I tell you what, that guy has got a bright future. And Finn Balor, just badass. So guys, comment down here. Also, in the description, go to the merch store. 20% off all the orders over 30 bucks. So get yourself some new gear. Lots of new stuff in there, especially the new unicorn shirt. You know, the New Day Unicorns. And uh, it's a way better one than the WWE design. So check out the new shirts. Get some new gear. You, know, you have a wrestling fan in the family 
Christmas is around the corner, so take advantage of the deal, and uh, prices are always right. So, guys, thanks for the support. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.